do you know that most companies are not ready for AI? Here's why. Every news article is saying that AI is transforming business, right? Well, I found out that the actual numbers tell a totally different story. I recently went through various corporate earnings calls, press releases, and company data, and I found something really shocking that completely contradicts everything we keep hearing about AI. I found out that 9 out of 10 US businesses aren't using AI. While every tech conference, every business podcast, every LinkedIn influencer is telling you that you're falling behind if you're not using AI, the reality is you're actually in the overwhelming majority for not using AI. I thought, okay, maybe this is old data. Maybe there's been massive growth recently. So I compared late 2023 to mid 2024. Then I found out how much AI adoption grew during what everyone's calling the biggest tech revolution in history, which was totally surprising. It went from 3.9% to barely 5%. I realized this cannot be called a revolution or even evolution. Meanwhile, I watched CEO after CEO go on news talking about their AI transformation and leveraging artificial intelligence for competitive advantage. Initially, I thought that these businesses aren't using AI because they're behind the times or stuck in the past. But that was not the case. They actually looked at it. They evaluated it. And then they made a conscious decision. They said, no thanks, we're good. And now these companies are doing just fine by focusing on the basics, like great customer service, building solid products, and maintaining good relationships. I realized that they're not chasing every shiny new trend that comes along. Instead, they're building real businesses on real fundamentals, which is working perfectly fine. So we've got two completely different realities here. First, there's the public narrative. This is what you see in the news. CEOs on TV talking about their big AI transformation and press releases promising that AI will give them a competitive advantage. It seems all of this is designed for one audience, investors. It's about keeping stock prices up, that's it. But then there's the ground reality, which is actually happening inside these companies. The truth is that most businesses are doing absolutely nothing with AI. They're just quietly serving their customers without any transformation. This shows a major gap between what companies say publicly versus what they're actually doing behind closed doors. Now we need to ask the real question here. Who actually benefits from all this AI hype? Because if 90% of businesses aren't using it, but everyone's talking about it nonstop, someone's winning from this story. And here's the answer. Look at the stock market. When a tech company announces anything about AI, their stock jumps. We're talking 30% increases just from an announcement, not from actual results or proven success. Just from saying the words, artificial intelligence, a company can add billions to their market value by talking about AI. Next question is, who benefits from this? The answer is shareholders of these tech companies and people who own their stock. This proves that the hype is for the Wall Street. So what should we do with all this information? At present, the best bet is to think like an investigator. Whenever you hear the next big thing, ask yourself some critical questions. Who profits from this story? What's the actual evidence behind it? Are successful companies really using this or just talking about it? Don't just take the hype at face value. Trust your business instincts. If 90% of businesses looked at AI and said, no thanks, maybe they know something the hype creators don't want you to hear. Maybe they understand that real success is about focusing on what actually matters, which are the customers, the product, and the relationships. Don't let the noise pressure you into thinking you're behind. In reality, you're not behind, so stay focused on building a real business as that's what works and actually matters. Hope you liked this video. Thank you for watching.